California banned plastic bags this week. Customers are going to have to bring their own reusable bags or buy them. Could a similar eco-friendly move ever be made here in Iowa? Steve Carlin joins us live from the Dolls Food Store on Ingersoll Avenue. Steve? Well, Stacy, nearly everybody who walks out of this store is, this store is carrying at least one plastic bag. So banning something that everybody uses would not be easy. California has banned single-use plastic bags because it sees them as an environmental enemy. Well, I think it's a good idea. I really do. But some at this Des Moines doll store see the sacks as a convenience. I don't, I don't think they should ban it. And a bag ban is going too far. Kind of dumb. Dumb or not, single-use plastic bags make up one-tenth of one percent of all trash that goes into the Metro East landfill. That's about 500 tons per year, or 1.6 tons per day. They are the landfill's number one litter problem. They blow very easily. See what look like soccer goals over there? They move those around here at the landfill every day just to catch the bags that fly around. They have bigger ones along Highway 163, and then they also have a truck that goes up and down the highway picking up any stray bags that the driver sees. That's how big a problem plastic bags are. Problems only arise when people get rid of them. Once the bags are buried at the landfill, they do not biodegrade very quickly. Nobody knows for certain, but it could be a very, very, very long time. You can't put them in your curbit cart because they can't be mechanically sorted at the recycling center. It actually binds up the equipment to the point where they have to shut down, clean them all out, and then start back up. The only way to effectively reduce their use is by changing behavior such as carrying reusable bags to the store or by implementing the biggest behavior modifier of all, a complete ban. I do think that it'll be a conversation that will happen across of our state, and but when it'll happen or if it'll happen remains to be seen. Now, there are three ways, according to the Metro Waste Authority, to properly dispose of plastic bags. Number one, tie a knot in the bags. That way, they don't blow around quite as easily. Number two, mostly, most grocery stores will recycle them if you bring them back. And some grocery stores will even give you a nickel a bag. But bringing you reusable bags with you to a store, uh, excuse me, but bringing reusable bags with you to the store is the very best method because that way you don't get any plastic bags at all. Reporting live, Steve Carlin, KCCI 8 News, Iowa's News Leader. And thank you, Steve. And looking back at our archives, other Iowa communities have debated banning these bags but eventually dropped the idea. Marshall County did pass a ban in 2009, but it only applied to unincorporated areas.